Alex? Yep. You ready to face your fears? Mm, yes. Bugs. Hi, Alex. We're so disgusting. No, they're cute. Hang up underneath the hand. Ready? No, grab it. Cute. Knees, hang on. Just breathe, honey. Don't bite me. Just no. breathe. That looks like a prawn. Oh. Good job. Sorry. Once one got on, I kind of just tried to breathe myself into being calm and come at ease with them. And then after, you know, a couple of minutes, I was playing around with them. Still a little bit scared, but it got a lot easier. I think my thing that I had to pose with was ridiculous. It looked more like a GHD commercial than my fear. So you've got no excuse but to strike the ultimate pose. My hard thing is to be elegant, though. That's my biggest fear. There you go. Maybe that's your biggest fear. When I spoke to Jamie and I let her know that claustrophobia was going to be her fear, she was definitely scared. I know, I know that's something that she's very nervous about. How's the claustrophobia going? It's OK. It's just a bit hot at the moment, but this is making me a bit dizzy. <laughs> now you've got to make it sexy, OK? okay. You've got to give me real strong poses in there. I can't you stand up. I was frightened at first when I saw the clown, but then I started talking to her and I realised that there was a person beneath the costume. Come on, Alamelli, give her a hug. Get in there, embrace the clown. Good girl. I've always just had an issue with public speaking, even through high school, doing okay. speeches and stuff like that. And Belle, so you're going to wrap up the evening? You ready to introduce today? As soon as Great. I got out there and had the microphone, everything kind of just went from my head and I couldn't really focus on anything. Hi, today I'd like to welcome everyone for coming here to watch the girls perform for, for you. I think I did really, really shit. Um, I'd like to help say thank you to Roxona for being here and for the event today. Um, so feel free to watch and look at the girls. I stuffed up so many times. Hi, first of all I'd like to welcome everyone for coming here today and watching the girls stick... Oh, and to be up there and everyone hearing you say the same thing over and over again in different ways. Yeah, I was embarrassed because I didn't get it first go. <laughs> Rebecca was perfect today. She came from the bottom all the way to the top she stayed cool and overcame the whole thing. If somebody just gives me a general outline of what I've got to talk about, I'm fine. Whenever you're ready. I could talk in front of a group of people forever. Can I have everyone's attention, please? I'd like to thank everybody for coming today. Rexo and the girl for sponsoring our event and all the models who are performing. No stress. Rexo and the girl supporting them. It's when they give me exact lines to say that my mind just goes... Choker. Absolute choker. Rexona girl, help, helping the girls in sticky situations. Once we finished the day off, Jonathan got us all together and he and Sarah Ford told us that somebody was going to take home a really good prize. So, ladies, today was a challenge. So, of course, there is a winner. And the reward is tickets to the David Jones 2008 collection show tonight. As soon as I heard that, I was like, oh my God, if I went through all of that with the bird and I don't win this, They'll I'm going to be, be so angry. They'll be backstage. They'll be meeting all the models, all the designers, all the VIPs, sipping nice champagne. <laughs> While the rest of you sit on the couch and watch a da da at home. So today's winners are Rebecca <laughs> and Karis. Well done, girls. Congratulations. You really earned it. Both of you really earned it today. I think that everyone thought that those girls deserved to win it. They all believe that Beck and Karis did really well. I think we could all see it. Next, the Megan Nation Grace. She's getting a tip. This is Rebecca and Karis. We walked up to Charlotte and she told us how this was like the big nut. So you rose to the challenge today, yeah. so you two get to party with me. Yeah. <laughs>
Tonight's a very, very special event because this is Megan Gale's last show. Too, okay? It's so rare to get that opportunity to go there and the fact that we got to go there like when we're so new to the industry was amazing. And all these people calling out your name and yelling at you, look over here, look over here. Hey. Oh, that was so just felt really like exciting, like to have such a little like the first taste of it just makes you want more. Did you get to meet Karis? Yeah, Karis? Hello. Rebecca? Hello. Hi. 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 Are you two of our girls? This is Colette Dinnigan. Hi. Colette, Hello. Nice Beth, to meet you. and Hi. Karis. Hi. This is Kiralee Johnson. Hi. I'm sure you've heard of her label. <laughs> it's exciting, isn't it? It is. It's too much. <laughs> this is Melissa Hoyer. Hi. Hi. Nice to meet you. Lovely to meet you both. She is the queen of fashion, social, and etiquette. Charlotte knows everyone, she's saying hello to all these people. They all gave us really good advice. Kind of something that we could take away from the night. I need more money. I really, really need more money. Like, desperately, like, mom, you need to tell mom to put in, like, $300 or something. I need, like, money. Because right, we well. go through it heaps quick. Alan, call them. Call them tonight. Tell us. Yeah, I wish you afterwards. Yeah, I always call your mum and dad. Yeah. It's just so. that, like, you, I just, we went shopping, but um, I didn't have enough money in there, so one of the girls gave me money, so I need to pay her back, but I just need money anyway, like, because you... All right, well, I, I told your mum about last, when your mum, but you know your mum, but all right, yeah, I'll, I'll ask her. All right, so let's head over to the door, because the show's about to start. Charlotte had said it was Megan's last show. When Megan Gale walks, no one can ever walk like her. Every time Megan came out, I was like, ah, I was getting really excited. Charlotte's like, settle down. <laughs> Megan Gale came down the runway for the last time. And everyone stood up and they applauded and she was crying and um, I think a lot of people were too. And I started tearing up. It was, it was like I'd known her for years and years. And Megan knows that you two are here. She's gonna come out and meet you. No. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> oh my god. So we're gonna Don't go meet you. Again. Cried. <laughs> You're gonna cry now. I was so excited, like I was thinking, oh my god, what am I gonna say to her? I'll probably end up being speechless. Hello. I noticed that you've been shedding a tear. This is Rebecca and Karis. Oh. I was so overwhelmed that I was meeting Megan Gale that I kind of didn't really hear much of what she was saying. <laughs> Block it out and yeah. just, you know, focus on what you your goal is. And that's She's just such an inspiration and to get to talk to her and see how lovely she is as a person was just such a great opportunity. Follow what she does and what that magic within her is and that's what's going to help make you top models. <laughs> Everyone kind of cleared out really quickly to the cocktail room. Charlotte told us that we had a chance to walk the David Jones runway. And go! Even though I wasn't in the show, it just felt so surreal. Like, it felt really important and it kind of felt like I could be in the actual show. It made me feel confident. That was awesome! That <laughs> <laughs> was got to walk the David Jones <laughs> runway! Oh, and you looked fantastic. Oh, Thank it was you. fun! <laughs> 10 out of 10. Oh, it was amazing. Um, Beck and I didn't want to leave. We were so excited. But I think as great as it was watching it, I'd much rather be a part of it. And I'm hoping I will be. Next, High Heels Views. Fine gravity, babe. Love it.